why you don't need long-term care insurance. A fact from the Alzheimer's Organization's website states that every 67 seconds, someone in the United States develops Alzheimer's. So, if you're one of those people, what would you do? Right now, there's no cure for Alzheimer's, and it's only one of many reasons that you or someone you love may need a nursing home. But I'll give you five reasons you don't need to buy long-term care insurance. And if you fit these parameters, save your money. One, you are lucky and you feel you will be among the 32% who will not need long-term care. You are comfortable taking risks, you're healthy now, and you expect to remain so. Two, you have 92,000 or less saved up. You don't need to buy long-term care insurance because your savings would pay for care at home or in a nursing home, then Medicaid would take over. Your assets would likely run out in a year of paying for care. The national medium for private rooms in a nursing home, 91,250 a year. That is from Genworth's 215 cost of care survey. That comes out to about 250 a night. And by the way, when you go on vacation, how much do you pay for a hotel room? 250 a night, more, less. Three, your income producing assets are likely over $5 million and can easily produce about 315,000 for your care, for other expenses for your home, for other family members, everything's taken care of. The same Genworth survey gives us a rough figure of 315,000 for an all around 24 hour private duty nurse. Four, you have a loving supportive group of family and friends who are able to learn how to care for you as a bedridden or ailing adult and they're willing to make your care part of their week every week for years. And you don't mind having your loved ones taking care of your personal needs. Five, you couldn't qualify for policy either because of cost or your health. You couldn't afford the premium without sacrificing some es essentials. You couldn't continue to pay for the policy if the premium rose. Another possibility is you have health issues and you would not be insurable. The American Association for Long-Term Care Insurance states that of those in their 60s, 25% can't get coverage. And those in their 70s, 45% are declined. So reasons you will go without buying long-term care insurance are, one, you are a risk taker and feel lucky. Two, you have less saved than a year's worth of care. Three, you have lots saved and you can pay for it out of pocket. Four, you have devoted caregivers. And five, you can't qualify for coverage either because of health or cost. If these five reasons don't fit you because you want to protect your money for retirement and you want to maintain your independence, you might want to revisit how to create a layer of protection against this risk. Give yourself a chance to think about it. Here's one resource. It's the second edition of my book, Long-Term Care Insurance, How to Make Decisions That Are Right for You. Mm -hmm.